So hello guys and welcome back to Learning MG. So many of you have been asking me lately as to why your actual uh, keyboard light doesn't work. So there's a few answers to this. The first one being that obviously you haven't got it activated. So basically, if you go here and you click this button, well, this is the, my version with the MacBook Pro that is currently uh, actually uh, not, not, let's say the not the newest version which basically has the touch bar or the newer versions. We do have buttons, but it's the same feature. It has the actual, as you can see, the actual light. Now, why might it, might it not work? So first of all, I would try and restart it. You know that we've already done a video on how to restart your MacBook. Basically, it's uh, you click Control, Command, Option, Command, all with the actual uh, turning off button. But basically, this is one of the main features as to why this may occur. And it's basically due to the fact that sometimes the connection done within the uh, MacBook uh, Pro uh, has to do with the actual, after a few years, sometimes there might be a malfunction in just that particular, uh, let's say, uh, hardware that uh, is in charge of giving the light to the actual keyboard. Now, uh, does it have a repercussion on the rest of the system? It shouldn't, because it's independent. So as you can see it's independent you can actually turn on and off the actual um light on the keyboard but it doesn't have to do with the actual screen because of course the light of the screen has got some actual uh, importance so what would i do i would try to restart it if not i would try to uh, leave the actual mac to run out of battery then do it again and then if it still doesn't work at least a little bit of light obviously i don't have to say that you should try to do this when there's no much sunshine because you can't really appreciate that when there's a lot of sun but i would try to take it to apple and see if there's anything wrong because sometimes it may just be a small part of the actual hardware that is giving some issues after time, after years, but it shouldn't be the case. I've got a uh, two MacBook Pros of 2015 and it hasn't had any issues, but it has occurred and it can actually happen and it's really relatively easy to solve, okay? So as always, if you like this video, please give the thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel because it will help the YouTube algorithm. And if you've got any questions about this video or any other video, just leave it down here in the comments below and me or anyone from the Learning MD team will answer shortly as possible. So thank you very much for watching.